Frozen dolls to open. And this is not like the music video that I did. It is just opening some dolls. So I will show you all my dolls now. So first I have Kristoff, which I'm so excited because I don't have a boy Frozen doll yet, but now I do. And on the back, it says Kristoff and it has a picture of the doll. And I have this Elsa doll, but I don't have that Anna doll. But I have two other Anna dolls besides the one that I'm about to open. Okay, and next, of course, like I was talking about, the Anna doll. And this is the Coronation Anna doll. So, and I've always wanted the Coronation doll, so this is pretty awesome. And it even comes with her PJs. And on the back is a picture of Anna, the Anna doll in, in her PJs. And, yes, that is what they had. And I also got the Coronation Elsa! Oh, and I'm so excited because I hear she's rare here where I live. Newfoundland in Canada. Well, not in Canada, but in Newfoundland. So, this is awesome. And she also comes with PJs, even though... Uh, there's no scene where she has her PJs on in a movie, unlike Anna, which her big messy hair. But, it's still pretty. And on the back, it shows the doll in her PJs. Just like the other one. So. We. We're gonna open these. Okay, so first on packaged, we have Queen Elsa. And I'll get a close up for you guys. So, these are her facial features. Open to the camera. And I really like her hair because it's almost exactly like it is in the movie. It's just, it's a bit higher. But, about here probably. But that doesn't matter because it's still really cute. And for the coronation, I'm, she does have her crown on, I'm pretty sure. And that clips into her hair like that. And it's actually a bit on with these little plastic things. So I'm not going to take those off. And now, here is the top of her dress, just like it is for coronation, I guess. And I love how silky it is, and especially the color. The color is almost identical. I think it is identical. And then for shoes, I'm going to look at the shoes for a second. She has little yellow shoes with actual snowflakes on them. You might not be able to see them very good, but they're pretty cute, I guess. I don't know if those are the real shoes. I'll have to look at the stomping part where she creates the castle, but still cute. Okay, and she also has her PJs here. I'll show you the individual pieces then on her. I'm not... Now I can see. Um, so, here's her nightgown. It's actually really, really cute. I love this. <laughs> And it even has the neck collar to protect, to cover up her black neck collar. And on the back, it is Velcro. So that is convenient. So that's her dress. Then she has cute little slippers that I'm going to show you. And I'm going to get them. So, oh! They're actually pretty fuzzy, and they have a snowflake, too, right there. It might be a bit hard to see on the camera, but see right there is the snowflake, and there's little fuzz details, and the fuzz goes up on the back, and there's a little bow, and then underneath there are tiny little snowflakes. And then last for her PJs. She has this sleeping mask. So you put it on your eyes like this. 
do do do. Oh, I'm sleeping. <laughs> and she can either have that on her put up on her head or down on her eyes if she's sleeping. So then it looks like your doll is sleeping. Okay, so we're back and Elsa has her PJs on. Although this thing just fell off. This is actually pretty hard to get on the right way. I mean, you can put it on anyway, but hard to get on the right way. So I'm just going to leave it off of her right now. Actually, I'm going to try to put it on for you guys. Hey, Elsa, how'd you do that? Actually, it's still not perfect. It's pretty ugly when you put it up there. So it's easier just to pretend that is she is sleeping for now if you want the mask on her. Ah, there, that's better. Okay, so what's her PJs on? Again, the beautiful gown. And her shoes are pretty nice. And her hair is actually really good. I think the hairstyle fits the look. I'm going to put her sideways. <laughs> So this is really cool. Though, the PJs, the only thing with the PJs is this is hard to get on the top of her head right. And these sleeves, this part isn't that stretchy, but it's like an elastic, but it's not that stretchy. So it's hard to get over her hands. But otherwise, it's pretty cool. So, I'm going to hold her back so you can see her perfectly. Here she is. Okay, so now let's see the beautiful Princess Anna out of her box. So the back doesn't have the design, but halfway to the back it stops. But that doesn't really matter unless you're twirling a lot. And if you twirl really fast, it doesn't, you can't notice it. But she obviously has her pretty design on the bottom of her dress, just like in the coronation. And of course, the, what do you call it? I don't know. The Arendelle symbols, just like uh, Elsa's dress has. She has her little necklace metal-like thing, which is pretty cute. And let's go to the shoes before we go to the hair. Mm, these shoes also have our sort of see-through, which make them really actually pretty. These are really, really pretty. Like, it's a different shade. It looks more red in the camera, but it's actually more like a hot pink. So it's really nice if you actually see it in the box or out of the box. Like we are. And it also has a little Arendelle. Uh, symbol and I, I just adore her shoes since they're see-through <laughs> and like Elsa's and then uh, her facial facial features are the same with the freckles and everything and her eyes are looking I think they're either looking straight or opposite ways I'm, I'm just saying straight they just look a bit opposite <laughs> but her hair is really nice I mean, it's not exactly like the bun on the thing on the movie where it's a bun and then strings hanging down. But it's still really pretty. And she still has that little braid up here. So that's perfect. And you can still see her little white streak back there. So, besides not being that round... It is perfect. Everything's perfect. Everything's perfect. <laughs> You're probably sick of that song. Okay. Now, I think she's tired, so let's get her in her PJs. Oh, and now she's back with her PJs on. Yay! And her shoe just, slipper, I should say, just fell off. So, for the shoes... I don't know why, but I just really, really love the color of her shoes. I like, I get the temp thing, the temptation 
to eat them. I really don't know why. I'm sorry, but really, I just really want to eat these. Anyways, um, she was a bit easier since her hair is, sorry, since her hair is more flat up here and there's nothing going down the side to bunch it up with. Uh, so this mask was really easy to get on and I'm guessing just because I already tried it once, I sort of got the hang of the sleeves, although it was still a bit difficult. Um, but, you know, you'll get used to it like me. And again, a bunch of pretty signs up here. It looks like it's supposed to be buttons. And she has a pretty ribbon too. And stripes at the bottom. So, I don't know if the hair fits it. It looks a little dolled up to go to sleep. But I put my hair in a bun sometimes to go to sleep. I, I guess. Oh well. Well, that was pretty cool. So, last but not least, we have Kristoff! And I don't know if this is from Frozen Fever or actual Frozen. Anyways, but he's kind of cool, I guess. He's mainly all plastic. His head is a bit weird. Oh, it makes that squeaking noise like the original Barbies would. And, okay, everything on him is plastic, except for this, and the only thing that you can remove on him is this and this belt. So that kind of sucks, but they got his elf shoes, so that's pretty cool. And even his hair, you can't flip his hair back and forth like, oh, whoa, 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 because it, it just doesn't go in the wind. It's, it's plastic. He's like one of those squeeze it Barbies. <laughs> hey, he breathes. Huh, well, let's store it off and upside, I guess. So, his, he's a bit different than the other dolls. But still awesome! Right, Kristoff. Right, Violet. Violet. Yeah, I can't do that. So, he is pretty awesome. He doesn't come with PJs, so that sucks. You know what? Disney or Mattel, you have to make PJs for Kristoff. And I don't know if you made a Han stall yet. But if you haven't Mega Hans doll, um, you need Sven, obviously. Actually, you have made Hans dolls and Svens and all that, because I've seen it on YouTube. But you can send me one, or or not. <laughs> Anyways, so one last look at Kristoff. Okay, so pretty much here are all the dolls. Sorry, it's facing towards me so I can see me so that's why it's weird like that so I need to find the angle again mm -hmm. so this is hard I'm just gonna try to show you the dolls uh, so here's yeah here's Anna in her PJs of course the next up is Kristoff. Then as you can see right next to him is Elsa and her PJs. So, I hope you liked this video. Like, subscribe, and comment below what you thought of the dolls. And thanks for watching, so bye.